With all the crap that happened at the Belgian Grand Prix yesterday at Spa, so obviously what George did on these tires was crazy. The strategy he called, the fact that he was like, hey, let's run these all the way to the end, ran them 34 laps, you know, at about a, it's like a minute 47, or I don't remember exactly what it was, but either way, that's a, it's a long lap, and at Spa, everyone knows that, and, you know, he did great, and obviously, we know what happened. Yeah, he posted this, and then, like, the first comment is, this post could age very quickly, and then two hours later, we find out Lewis breaks the F1 win record, previously held by Lewis Hamilton, at 105. So, it was because the car was underweight by, it was, I think, a kilogram and a half. Now, the reason that, obviously, is going to affect him, it's like, you don't know where George would have finished now, because if the car was underweight, Lewis might have caught him, Oscar might have caught him, caught him, Charles might have caught him, whoever. So then, you know, it dequalifies George, and... Um, you know, brings everyone out, put position. So Lewis ends up winning. Oscar takes second. Charles takes third. Ferrari turned it around too. And then we get Oscar, Carlos going to Williams too. Another thing on this though that is good is Lewis, you know, pretty much commented to George and said, you know, great guy today. Really am gutted for you and the team for losing the one, two that they deserved. Let's keep going. Um, work for another one, two in the second half. And I mean, I didn't think Merck was going to do well this weekend and look what happened. It was a great weekend for them, but it makes me feel bad for George. And the thing is, is that could happen to anyone. It could happen to Lewis. It could have easily happened to Lewis because it happened to his teammate. It could have been his car instead of George's. So either way, yeah, this was an interesting weekend. I mean, I had money on Lewis, so I was happy with it. Uh, but yeah, that's what happened.